Welcome back to the Wizards Forum 2023. I'm now delighted to be joined by Cesar Onoi, who's the director of the Telecommunications Standardization Bureau at the ITU. Mm. So, thank you. Tell me what the ITU standards are doing in terms of support of the knowledge societies reducing the gaps and, of course, getting towards those SDG goals. Okay, uh, technical standards provide a technical foundation for global connectivity. And uh, technical standards also uh, help us uh, to share the innovation worldwide. Uh, in fact, 95% uh, of uh, internet, international traffic uh, runs over the uh, optic fiber networks uh, built to the ITU standards. Also, the, the uh, video, uh, it uh, counts over 80%. Uh, it is en enabled by the uh, uh, video coding standards, uh, uh, jointly de developed by the I IEC, ISO, and ITU. IT standards offer the secure, reliable, and uh, cost-effective uh, infrastructure. The ITU standardization platform is growing in value uh, to a growing number of stakeholders. And so what are the challenges facing standards developers, especially in this time of accelerating the digital transformation? And what's the ITU doing to meet these challenges? Yeah, uh, ac acceleration of digital transformation makes uh, us need a diverse set of ex expertise. Uh, to understand the full implication of the new use cases in, uh, in different sectors. So uh, digital transformation is also creating a convergence in the businesses in different sectors and, and uh, associated convergence in the uh, responsibilities of the uh, reg regulators. So uh, this is why IT is so invested in bring, uh, bringing uh, people, uh, experts, uh, from the uh, very different uh, sectors and in industries. ITU standardization work is dri driven by a contribution and a consensus de decision by all participants. These uh, actions uh, contribute to, uh, to the acceleration of the digital transformation. Well, that's great. That was very concise. And um, you gave us some really good detail on that. So, Cesar Uno from the ITU, thank you very much. Thank you very much.